Hello, everybody, and welcome to Remember Me. Um, I have... These were very difficult 10 minutes for me because I had to look at this screen and it is giving me actual motion sickness. I'm going to try and leave it as soon as possible. Wow. Yeah. Uh, I just saw this for a second and... Uh, ow. Yeah, that is, that's really not... To, do not do these kind of menus ever. Oh my god, please stop. Ah. Okay. I'm staring at Discord. Tell me when it's done. Yeah, yeah, I'm just trying to make sure everything. I think this might be capped at 3 FPS, it's being weird. Whatever. Um. Oh my god. Why would you have menus move? I don't know. Uh, script kitty, enjoy a story, no need to be a top fighter. Errorist agent, got nice. Good pun. Uh, the ideal challenge for frequent gamers, memory hunter, test your limits. We're gonna go with errorist. Also, Eris Agent, I'm gonna remember that. After our boat sank, I was the only refugee to reach the shore. I held my husband's hand until the very last second. I can still feel he, the nails of his fingers sticking into mine. I'm gonna you keep know? quiet because I can barely the see the subtitles. The first said to me, let's share our memories. I remember I was sort of afraid, but um, <laughs> and he smiled and... We hit the switch together, and then I felt everything. Oh, for the first time, I was I was living all of his love for me. It it felt so warm and so strong that it it almost hurt. For the last three years, every day has been our first day. <laughs> the weather was so hot that day. The streets stank of this awful smell of burning plastic. I walked with the other children across town until we were outside of Paris. No one fired. The war was over. I don't know if I'll ever find the courage to give these memories to my son. But I'm relieved to know that they are all safe and secure. Thanks to my sensen, I choose to remember every defining moment of my life. Good ones and the bad. Thanks yeah, I can barely sense. see it. Like, and I'm playing this. My husband lives on. Here? Yeah. And here. Well, I've already got some questions to... Some, some answers to some questions I had going into this. Episode zero. Memory Dropbox, yeah. Back up your memories. Uh, and I was gonna like go and talk and like ask how people were doing and say new stuff about the channel, but I can't because the menu was motion sick sickening and the cutscenes have tiny subtitles, so it's like let's just play the game. Uh, I guess. I killed most of the viewers. But yeah, we're back, break is over, we're going balls deep to finish the current playthrough list. Good day. Can you hear me? Yes. What is your name? Marin. What year? What did you say? Nillin. You're not Nillin. Now that's a first. Not to worry. We'll scrape away those last memories. What year is it? I, I don't know. It's 2084. Do you know where you are? No. Not so resistant after all. Thank you for where? your cooperation. I hope that man dies. He seems like a dick. Hopefully soon. Hopefully we Dr. see him die. Yes. This subject is displaying some resistance. Complete the substitution protocols, then send her to me. I'll erase the last barriers myself. Yes, Doctor. Control A, delete. Shift delete, actually don't send it to the recycle man. Uh. 
Good day. Raise your head, please. Thank you. Now stand up. Okay. Please follow the orange line to your next assignment. So by the way, this is from the same people who did Life is Strange, I believe. Mm-hmm. And Vampire. And Vampire. Or from Peter. We'll see. Vampire's mostly why I was curious about this game, because... I wanted to see if they learned anything from this game. If they because remember their mistakes. Because... I like Vampire, but it's got a whole mess of problems with it. This is also an action game. Yeah, like I, I don't really like shaky cam, Kane and Lynch style. I hope she kind of stabilizes soon. This is a Yeah, she like cutscene wobbliness. Yeah, I, I, I really hope it stops. And we and we never do it again. Please stand in line and wait for your turn before sitting down on the chair. Imagine, in the future I'll be able to forget about Inferno Climber. It's buried too deep in your Nilla, mind to be rid of. Can you hear me? Yes. They're about to wipe your brain now. Don't let them do it. I need to create a diversion. Be ready to move when I say. Who are you? I'm the voice you have to listen to if you want to live. Don't leave me alone. Do oh, I have to press forward? Not allowed to press any other direction except forward. That got their attention. Nilla, the large metal shutter is going to raise on your left. If you understood me, move your head. I'm linked to your sensei. I'll feel it. The door. Go under it. Now. Okay. Ooh, thank God that robot shut off. Imagine if we had a fighter, that would be really bad. Okay. Fail at it for a good five minutes. Camera is still a smidge shaky. Oh no. It's cop lock. The passage on your right, take it. Get up. You've got to keep going. So you know they're serious, Tyrion. Nope, it's still shaking. Oh my fucking god, the game. Please, I, I, I sincerely hope it, this isn't the entire game. Like, it can't be. If it was, like, I would know. People would tell me it was unplayable. Yeah. Where am I? Can't turn it off in the options. I'll check after this cutscene. Slide into a casket. Quickly. I kind of doubt because it doesn't seem like a, a game with good accessibility options.
Difficulty, subtitles, video settings, audio settings, no. No, it doesn't seem like we have anything. Wait, this is from 2013. That's like six years ago. We didn't know how to make video games back then. The ocean sickness, what's that? Just, just get healthy, scrub. I confirm they learned not what motion sickness is. Strange at all. Get health scrub exactly, comma. Ah, we got the achievement. Dead man's chest. Oh shit, we have quotes. It's one of those games. Nilan, are you okay? No. I need to get out of here! Get me out of here now! Calm down. My name is Edge. You have to trust me, sis. I just did, bro, and now I am trapped in a coffin! <sighs> I must prepare you for what is waiting outside. The enemy is Memorize, a corporation that has digitized and commoditized memories. They call it Sensei she Technology. She is having a panic attack. Why are you exposing to you her? Fall. Yes. You were a memory hunter, Nilla. The best. Other hunters merely pillage memories, but you can remix them. And above all, you are an errorist, just like me. Why did they do this to me? You were a revolutionary fighter and my best agent. We all fought to assure that no firm might build a monopoly on all human memories. But I failed. We were rounded up and imprisoned. Oh, 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 this is all very interesting, but I really have to get out of this coffin now! The currents are going to take you to slum 404. Once you've landed, I'll tell you my plan. Ah, that's what the game's called, okay. Now it's a real episode. Get slum 404, like error 404, file not found, because nobody finds these slums. I mean, mean, I'm sure that was very clever uh, in 2013. Hey, Lolo. Listen, Johnny is crying. <laughs> and there are serum mutants in the memory apocalypse feature. The thing on their back, like, looks like I'm having graphical issues with my PC, which I guess was the point, but still. <laughs> Lost now, a new us, tears and grins. Lost. Look, Lost. a new us, pain is shared now. Dark pain is lost now. Been searching a long time. Yeah, this is where all the memory wiped people end up. Is that it? Oh, time to punch. Okay. I don't want to fight you. You're gonna have to, Neil, and these guys will kill you. Use your presence. 
Excuse me? What? This, no, just tell me how to do it in the game. Don't open the menu for this. Uh, okay. The input sequence of a combo is predetermined and immutable, okay? Okay. What? Uh, okay. Okay. Okay, so I have to pick the buttons and put them in my combo. Okay, got it. So it's kind of like God Hand, except less intuitive. Also, in God Hand, they actually start you off with a basic combo, and only after you play a full level, it shows you customization. Okay. The now comments below the bottom of the screen provides real time button press feedback on the combo you are performing. Okay. That was a very convoluted tutorial for what is essentially Mash Square. Well, you just ate their souls. No, their memories. You gotta forget their ass kicking. Leapers. Miserable castoffs left to rot in the depths of Neo Paris. Miserable. Monstrous, more like. They are the abandoned children of our Sen Sen age. Simply humans, like you or I, but cast as shadows of our shame. Something we are meant to fear. Another justification for the errorist cause. I hate the term errorist. I like it, but I hate it as well. It's like... I don't know, do terrorists refer to themselves as... Like, it's a pun on terrorist, obviously, but do terrorists consider themselves terrorists? I I, I don't think think of themselves as the good guys. So yeah, not. yeah, but like, like here you're going like, oh, I'm a I'm, I'm a terrorist. It's like, what the hell? I mean, do they call themselves terrorists, not terrorists? Like it would be cool if terrorists were like, what people call them, but they're like, we're not terrorists, okay. we're we freedom fighters. Go find Headache Tommy. Uh, I told him freedom we were back who? Nice. He runs a bar at the top of Slum 404. Start by climbing out of this dump, and I'll give you directions as and when. Okay. Press to jump and grab a ledge. Okay, that is a weak ass jump. Wow, that is a super. That is super anemic. I f I feel she jumped higher while I was fighting. Does anyone recognize Edge's hand in this? He's promised to bring down the civilization. One thing is certain. The number of errorists freely roaming our beloved city dead of the Yeah, so they call them errorists, so I guess they're like wearing that as a badge of pride. I don't know. Let's just drop down and punch a bunch. Iggy, I wouldn't mind the distortion if the subtitles were actually big. Like, look at this. Look, like, this message is super big. Why is the subtitle not this big? Because mm, cultural memories of Neo Paris and an effort to file forms of ignorance caused by memory loss. Okay. Uh, there are can be read in the journal, sense, and menu. Oh god, it's so bright. My eyes. Oh god. Just. Ow. It's not shaking anymore. Oh my god, look at all this lore. Holy shit. This walls of tiny text. Hits shared. I remembered. I had forgotten. Okay. Up's the only way out of here. Yes, many lessons they learned from this. They got better at doing lore entries in Vampire. And combat. 
not oh. by much, mind you. Combat's like the worst part of Vampire, but better than this. Well, we'll see. Um, we only started combat here. Who is this Tommy guy? Uh. Tommy was your closest friend. A former memory hunter who's still faithful to our cause. His bar is in a cargo hull over the canal locks in slum 404. The leaking brain. You can't miss it. The leaking brain. At least it owns it, its theming. Like everything is called with Cyberpunk key. Some sort of memory rest. And just... Yeah. Can't wait till we get to Alzheimer's Alley. I do like the in-world text. Uh, Food served all day at the Leaky Brain. Today's specials: crunchy crab cake a la Tommy and sewer shrimps in slum sauce. Yeah, I like all of this text. Like, it reminds me a lot of that space. I think that's cool. It just like pops in a very weird way. Like, I can't really explain it. Like, it doesn't look like it's being. I guess it's- I guess probably is, like, being shown in her brain. Or rather than a hologram, like, in Dead Space. But then why does it rotate? It's very weird. I don't know, it just pops in a very weird way to me. Oh, wow, that's not good, though. Look at that, how tiny that is. <laughs> Eris left a memory of a hidden stash for you to find. Study the picture carefully and find the indicated area in your surroundings. Uh, it's a bunch of junk on the corner. Is it over uh, there? Where are all the people? Looks like Is yeah. Someone up here? Is it this? Oh, it does, it does this kind of health upgrade. I never really liked that. I always prefer, like, you find a thing, here's a little incremental upgrade, rather than find X amount of things before you get an upgrade. Yeah. Because it, like, it really delays, um... Oh, wait, I need to... Wait, where am I meant to go? Oh, okay, that little arrow there. I, I don't like the, like, collect five things and you get a health upgrade, because let's say you like, miss two out of the five, like, that considerably delays when you actually get a health upgrade and then you punish people for not playing well by making it harder for them to play. Okay. If you're just low on health, press this to enter a sensing menu. Enter the combo lab. We unlock the five-hit combo, okay. Region presence, okay. Whenever Nilan performs a region presence, she will regenerate some health, alright. Use these new presents to customize your combos. Okay. Uh, let's. Oh, okay. It's already telling. Can I do like? Oh, okay. I can't actually lay it out the way I want. That's. Then, Bad. then what is this? Maybe it's like a tutorial thing. But like. Oh. Well, what's the point of me laying this out if I can't lay out the order? I don't know. I like how the music starts and immediately stops because I allowed myself to get ahead. Oh. 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 
These punches definitely need like more impact behind them. But it feels very anemic. Yeah. Yeah. These the, the, like better sound, definitely. <laughs> game based off of Lambier stuff. I mean, Lambier games usually handle much smoother. But also, I don't think they've ever actually done proper melee combat, so I wouldn't know. How they handle something like this. Shooting is much easier to do than melee combat. That's just like a general thing. Like, if this was released today, it would definitely need a like better set of visual options. Like, the VFX is like really strong. Like, I don't usually get motion sick, but this is a bit much. Same. You know, I'm, I'm reminded of uh, Echo, uh, which I don't have in stream, but it's like a little indie game from X Hitman devs. And then it has like this weird, surreal aesthetic to it, but it doesn't really have uh, distracting effects. So what's this? Okay, it's like... I'll lay with a pile of shit on it. Yeah, it's just like, here's a pile of shit, it's not even like something... What is that, a robot arm? Do I see a robot arm anywhere? I don't know, I guess it's probably I, further away. Oh, no. I think... No, it's not that. Yeah, it's right there. It's probably one of these. Not probably no. It's across the way there. What was it? This was probably after Arkham Asylum because it feels a lot like Arkham Asylum, only less mashy. You have reached a PMP threshold and can now unlock presence. Okay. Okay. Nil against PMP. Is that pump or pimp as she fights? Procedural mastering points are. Oh, that's what it means. Okay. Are used to unlock forgotten presence. No one has enough PMP to unlock a new present. Think about how you can use this uh, new present to create longer and better combos. Uh, unlock. Yes. Yes. Yes, we will put it there. Cool. Can I like? Okay, can I swap this? Can I? Do like this. I, I want to feel like I have some customization. Okay, so we don't have like attack order control. We have attack type control. Okay. So. Oh, I can't like practice combos and this is this is me trying to do a combo. It doesn't actually let you um, do stuff if you're not in combat mode. Okay, sure. That's like whatever, that's like just how it's set up. I think this is where the box was, yeah. It also has these very like brief flashes. I don't know if they're coming across on stream, but it's like yeah, it's just like very uncomfortable to play. Get off of me! Please don't have quick time to win events, please. Okay. Oh, okay. I have to go here, 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 and then here. Give me your face! Your face! 
I've lost face! Uh, Bad child! I, I lied! The flies are eating me! Oh, oh he's dead. Or he's dead. They're dead. Yeah. Oh, look, it's a big enemy. It's time to fight the boss. If it looks like, like an enemy type, I don't think that's a boss, but what do I know? Yeah, this is extremely early 2010s. Oh, with a tutorial for dodging. Scanner is much stronger when other leapers are around. Defeat the leaper probably before you go after him. Okay. Also, this game tries like to go like, oh, time your strikes, and I honestly don't think it really needs timing, considering I have to keep trying to remember like the specific combos anyway. Just need buffer attacks. It makes the flow much better. It would be good if it was like, oh, time your attacks for extra damage. That I'd be okay with, but just like... Okay. Two, 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 two. The dodge is pretty good though. I like the contextual dodge where you jump over uh, the enemy, that is really good. Check him out now, okay. Okay, he's dead. The Leapers are attacking citizens. Leapers were citizens. All right. I'll believe you. Come on, move it. Tommy's waiting for you at the Leaking Brain. Leaking Brain? But I'm already here. Look at all these Leaking Brains. Cracked open their skulls with my fists. Also, all these people are dead. Wait, is everybody? Was that push person that was pushed into a wall also dead? Probably. They look like a character. I mean, that's very sad. I thought they were somebody important. I guess they're just generic citizens. Wow. They had a lot of emotion for a generic NPC. Emotion of, I don't want to be beaten up by mutants. To be fair, that is a very valid emotion. Ooh, wow, primary drop. Um, I guess that's one way to load the next area. They have become productive servants of society. The reconversion project by Memorize. Humane responses to barbaric perils. Citizens of Neo Paris. Believe. Here a thought, like. Does it seem nicer when you're playing like a game like like Tomb Raider and it's just color coding what you can grab like with white color and stuff like that, or when you have you when everything looks more realistic but you just have a UI telling you jump here, even if it's in the universe AI, UI? Right. Color coding. Is that that one? I think I prefer like Tomb Raider's approach. Like, even if it's jarring, just color it because that well, floating UI is. I don't know, I don't like it. Do I think new Parisians look at Neil London as with the Cross the floating Probably. market to that warehouse. It's a shortcut to Tommy's bar. Okay. Nothing here. 
kind of looking forward to leaving this area because it looks very brown gray. They'll let anyone into this district. Okay, I won't. As good as fresh, but not actually. I don't think that this is the story you're looking for. Wow, okay. Try somewhere else. Is this one of those games where as soon as you approach an NPC they say shit about you? The then is found technology. Oh god, I'm gonna stop opening this pause menu, it just burns my eyes. Okay. Oh my god, this is I'm, this is a lot of lore. I guess men is not fashion anymore. Much lore. You're cute, okay. but I'm busy. What you brush your hair with? A grenade? <laughs> I think I'd rather meet your sister. Jeez. Everybody here's a dick. I'm not interested. I didn't even approach you. Roughly in the Neo Paris. Sorry, I'm waiting for someone. It has this weird camera angle when you find an item, and I don't know why it does that. Just like takes you out of it. Did somebody die? Okay, I guess they did. Just another day in Neil Paris. No! Oh, for fuck's sake. <sighs> oh, okay, I have to re pick up. What I was wondering what happened. The third catwalk I activated had a jump on it, and I didn't see it. Was that the second? Oh, that's the third so far. This is where I climbed up, okay. Man, one trend I do like with these precision platforming um, games these days is like, like if I were to run around here, like say in like Sekiro, uh, you'd have like an invisible wall, uh, which would only go away after you jump. I see. That's like, and a lot of games do that. That's really nice because then you avoid just jumping down and dying. Change that fancy costume. Oh my god, what fancy costume! Metal boards, push. Can I push this man? No. That's not pushing, that's like kick down. Ah, uh, please don't do that. Oh. Okay. Oh. See a full time apparently. Every time. What was that thing? That's a good sign, sister. With time, other memories will come back. Okay. Uh, what? There it is. Nope! Ah, oh, you idiot. Almost there. Follow Tommy's flying drones to his bar. Hey, it's me. Oh, now you tell me. Give me a memory, man. Anything will do. Just need a fix. My last one. And I'll stop. Second hand cyber orgasm. You're two steps away from a Second hand cyber orgasm. Wow, that is quite the term. Oh. Nice shot, Cottage. Two 
to err is is what human to err is human no no it's human oh, human what okay sure like our errorists and freedom writers caution caution high voltage so do I it turned off so I think it's just a time thing oh okay And I'm glad this game isn't particularly long because the camera work is really bad. Don't stop, stop. Can't stop, won't stop. Well, no going back. Both, so. Oh no, this was the correct way. Can I go back? Oh, I need to go the other way because there's probably a collectible down there. God, almost missed the collectible. Crisis averted. The leaking brain. Where? Oh, over there, okay. But yeah, I was gonna say, I'm really glad this game isn't too long because holy shit, like, these weird mm -hmm. screen shakes and bright flashes and camera angles. Not doing it for me. Lax punch. Nope, no pun intended. Bob, shut up. Oh, I'll left for a tiny chunk, okay. I've got nothing for you. Well, I have nothing for you either, lady. Pretty, but you're not my style. I'll eat your damn heart if you don't quit blubbing, yeah. Mem junkie. Yeah, whenever whenever I see people in the world, I have to like address every single person. Stupid mem junkie. Johnny wants my heart for Christmas. You know, you know that, huh, Tommy? You're safe here, Bob. Don't sweat it. Well, OP! Edge did it! <laughs> Come here, sweetheart! Neilan, it seems like a lifetime. I'm sorry. I have no memory of you. You really can't remember this pretty boy face of mine? I'm sorry. Hell. Well, well, we all lost bits and pieces in the war. But you're free, sweetheart. That's what counts. I guess. Feels like I'm lost. First things first, sister. Let's get you out of those straps. Well, that could be taken the wrong way. How's the game so far? Uh, I really wish it had less shaky cam. Like, it's very uncomfortable to play. That glove over there? It's yours. Rescued it from your safe house, along with your fancy combat skin. Lucky thing they caught you on a day off. Now this is a hundred percent Nilin. Way above the model I used to use. It's 
beyond me, sister. You're the only one who can use it. What did they do to you? Down there, in La Bastille. Unlike you, I had to stay for the whole program. Well then, let's get you changed. Your combat skin is in the locker. How did I come upon this? Uh, it's one of those games I kept meaning to check out, and it's one of those games I keep hearing uh, average things about, and we're all about highlighting these weird average games nobody plays. Because usually people either play super good games or super bad games, but here we go super center. I'll call Johnny. Unless it's Infernal Climber, then it's rock bottom. Risk of him turning you over to Olga Sadova. The bounty hunter? Is she dangerous? Determined. She'll turn the slum inside out to catch you. Not just to catch you. Typical brain rat. Barely outside and already working. Dylan? Dylan! This is for you, David. A remix memory? Ooh. Ow! Flash! My eyes. Nice beam. Time for my Space Jam mashup. I should mock your channel, I play average game. I mean, my LPs were... Usually fairly average games. Or weird quirky games. <laughs> Only the okayest games. I mean, it's a market. Nobody's taking it over. Everybody's like, oh, I'm gonna stream Sonic 06, but how many people do you know that stream Sonic for the for Master you, System? This memorial transfusion has a good chance of healing your husband, Mrs. Sadova. Shared happy memories have an extremely positive impact on patients. The syndrome that your husband suffers from is a classic. Excessive memorial deletions, acute dependency on stirring mnemonic triggers. Aggravated risk of voter identity. Short, inevitable shattering of already fragmented personality. Here, these endorphins should lubricate the process and help ease his receptivity to the transfusion. So not exactly getting it. It's like everybody addicted to memories, or did like the, or is that the entire on, memory Remember economy us. just broken? Remember yourself. Memorial transfusion. Company. That's what they said, that there are addicted to memories. But it's like the entire population. Memorial afflictions. Apparently. Everyone's on the memory drug. Everything will be alright. With time. Yes. Of course. Ah, good. The initial results are encouraging. We need to schedule more treatments. Great deal more. It's an extremely expensive process. Continue, Dr. Quaid. So I can cover his treatment. We're public enemy number one, but we're only worth 300,000 euros. I assume we'd at least be in like seven digits. That's perhaps the economy's been hit too. Make Dr. Quaid kill David. What? The objective is to alter this scene so Dr. Quaid kills David so though instead of curing him? Okay. The first step is to find memory glitches you can interact with. Okay, rotate backwards until you find a memory gl glitch. Hold to rewind faster. Okay. What does a memory glitch look like?
You're approaching memory glitch. Rotate it backwards slower and slower and stop on the glitch. How slow? Did I miss it? Memory I don't think so. Okay. Is the best hospital for the treatment of memorial affliction. Okay. Everything will be all right. With time. Yes. Of course. Ah, good. The initial results are encouraging. We need to schedule more treatments. Great deal more. It's an extremely expensive process. Continue, Dr. Quaid. I can cover his treatment. Okay. Okay, so I have to, like, figure out... as much as I'd like to see how this plays out. I've gotta go. Alright, catch you later. Yep, see you later. Okay, so we're cancelling this and we're going further back. For the next thing. Okay. Untie that. Is there anything else, like, back in the memory? Might be another one. Is that a memory glitch? No. Okay, that's the memory limit, so all I see is the mask and the strap. Oh, no, there's something there, okay. Capsule switch. Why are we exactly doing this? Are we gonna, like, trick her to think her husband's already dead? Do I just like activate everything? There's no like limit to combo things. Here, these endorphins should lubricate the process. So how goes jogging your memory? Um, if you get an easily motion sick or a headache, I am really sorry. Memorial flux in progress. Ease and please receptivity for the transfusion. Uh, also, is the side stream supposed to be mute? Uh, kinda. We're rewinding memories right now. No, because I checked the mainstream and it wasn't mute. Uh, I didn't hear any complaints from death. Let me just finish this segment and I'll check it out. I also have no fucking clue what's happening. So, we're remixing <laughs> the bad girl's memories. Hey, why does this man have a fried egg on the back of his neck? Wait, am, am I killing her in the memory? Oh, I am. Okay. I think this is like a detective scene or something. Okay, but why egg? Tachycardia. 
is unusual. Doctor, what? It's a little flush to worry about. Try to focus on the memory. Come on, Dick. Remember us. Remember yourself. For the cloud parts, why do you crawl? What? The flies need me. The flies take me. Can you hear stuff now? Nope. Can you try another browser? Yeah, I can try. Your husband is extremely resistant. He didn't recognize me. All that rage, all that pain. Regardless, my diagnosis was accurate. We'll need to increase the dosage and, in and intensify the process. Operations need to be scheduled. There are quite a few Did more. Miss something? It's an extremely expensive process. Continue, Dr. Quaid. I can cover his treatment. Nope, still mute. Okay, let me quickly check. I don't know why it would be. Nope, it's not me on my end. Oh, wait, it is. Shit, what's wrong with this? Oh, I know what's wrong with this, okay. Give me a hot second. Uh, the thing that's wrong is Windows Update. Hell yeah! Voice major input. Box output. Surprise death didn't say anything. Can you hear it now? Yep. Okay. Cool. Alright. Okay, so I think the table was the problem, so I need to go back and undo the table. Cancel that one. I don't want to cancel that. Don't worry about get the mask. Yeah, we're trying to change the memory so that this guy dies. Okay. I love the sweet surgery gun. Yeah, Naren, that's basically what's... Yeah, what Naren says is basically what's happening. We're altering her memories to change her motivations and make her not actually want to kill us. 
That's pretty fucked up, actually. Hey, it's... It's how it works. You know, like how, how Mario I'm, hijacks people's memories. You Do you still plan to take down Memorize? Yes. Then we share the same enemy. This is really messed up. Like, she's gonna find out the He's truth right. eventually. I mean, a happy this is turn supremely up. fucked up for everyone. I know Alpha has her own reasons. Actually, just the one reason. The great Olga Sadova siding with the Errorist Revolution. Has everyone got a fried egg on the back of their neck? Must That's their uh, the memory unit. Last time I took you in, you were young and quick on your feet. Just because you're not on my list doesn't make us drinking buddies. <laughs> Don't oh sweat man, it. that's those are some we'll weird fingy gloves. We can for two. But Nilin has a rendezvous with high society, and the route is alive with surveillance. If you got any ideas, she's gonna figure it out eventually. Like, she, doesn't she have to arrange a funeral? Like, isn't she gonna realize at one point, oh, her husband is just alive? Or she's gonna get a bell or something. That's the Nilan I know. A magician. Nobody can turn heads quite like you. First you hit me! Not gonna touch on then this. you ruin my little business. Are we the you baddies? Want a relationship, you got one. Whatever, we're wasting time. You know, maybe everyone's bad. Maybe there are no Thanks. good guys. Tommy, truly. You haven't lost it, sweetheart. Edge was right to bet it all. This is a way too cheerful tone for what we just did. Uh, like, this is like Supreme Everybody's Best Everybody's counting on you! To be fair, they don't know what we did. No, th this guy knows. Like, the guy on the oh. screen right now. Yeah, he knows what we are and what we do. He's just playing long. Achievement Lock, Forge Alliance. Oh, so yeah, there are inspirational quotes. Okay. Just saying. Well, not inspirational quotes. They're they're profound quotes. My head may still be full of amnesia, but the risks Tommy and Edge have taken to free me have got me feeling troubled. Now they want me to punish Neo Paris's privileged few. Edge talks about a clandestine mission to be accomplished in the heart of the Saint Michel Comfortress. About a brutal wake up of this high security district, making it fertile for the seeds of revolution. And why not? Though his fight is legitimate, it's his friendship that has been clinging to my drifting thoughts. Why did our enemies erase my memory? Am I really that dangerous? Lady, do you realize what you just said? You're fucking lethal. I can feel the throb of the power that scares them so. It scares me too. The power to take what someone is, their memories, and bend them to my will. To rewrite their history. To play God. I feel like it's a little too late for a crisis of faith. If this ability really is the core of who I once was, then I must relearn what has been taken from me. I must master this talent. Like, this is that school of protagonists, like, how Mario and Mario Odyssey takes over people's bodies, or how the dude from uh, Shadow Mordor basically possesses orcs to be his friends. To be fair, at least she has some idea of how terrible what she's doing is. Oh, well, let's see by the end of the game. Oh, Welcome thank God you're Michelle District. Thank you for flying, Air Sadova. <laughs> Good hunting. I could do with a guide. No can do. Family business to take care of. Ooh, she's gonna find out. Your first target's name is Carrie Sheridan. I need some confidential codes hidden in her memory. Who is she? The most famous architect in Neo Paris. Stored in her brain is every detail of every building she's designed. How do I find her? Your contact goes by the name of Bad Request. He's waiting on the last floor of the Sam. Bad Center. Request, wow. Also, man, that is an impressive architect if she can remember every single building she's designed. That's pretty... 
like that's pretty hard. Clean drone needed, sorry for the inconvenience. Somebody put two perfectly fine milk jugs here in the corner instead of in the trash. Fucking savages, I expect better from Paris. Do you? Sorry, Neo Paris. Okay. Okay, but look at that bakery. Keep it cool. Keep it cool. Pine ou chocolat. Ah, a baguette. Okay, so I'm gonna say something really dumb here. Uh, I've never seen a pine ou chocolat called Good like man. this. You have arrived just in time to Thank you for the follow. Um, un Good until you have oh, arrived just in I think these are old follows, and the muxiler is now working. Um, Young man, you have arrived just in time. I'm gonna wait for that to pass. <laughs> and look at this sweet, sweet pastry. You have arrived just in time to watch Jesus fucking guy. Christ. Yeah, there was a backlog of follows and only now yeah, it's man. turning on. You have arrived just in time to watch Anyway, thank you for the follows. A few people are here, I appreciate it. Anyway, I did not have a pine or chocolate until I moved to Sweden. But also because I am severely paranoid of pronouncing French words, I try to order it, like whenever I can without actually referring to what it is. I just call it a chocolate pastry, and they're like, what, what do you mean? I'm like, uh, find the pine or chocolate. And then they stare at me as I butcher it. You know what? Fuck them. Uh, also, I, what are those, neo-euros? Yeah, they're neo-euros. They're neuros. I feel like five neo-euros is a bit much. Is nobody gonna do anything about this pigeon? Look, that pigeon ordered his food just like oh. anyone else. Do not fucking judge. Lady, are you working over here? Like... Ugh, disgusting. That pigeon is a paying customer. Okay, okay, but let's look at, like, this world building. This man's coffee has steam. Sorry, I'm waiting for someone. That lady's coffee has steam. That empty comp doesn't because it's empty. But this one does. See? Like, attention to detail. Damn. Actually, I think that's a really good attention to detail. Also, you just look like a fucking weirdo right now, just staring at everyone at this cafe. I mean, I would gladly move, but I'm forced to walk everywhere. Few, safe with their little comforts, while others live in suffering a few meters from their barricade. No one chooses which side of the firewall to grow up on. It's the side of the firewall, oh my fucking god. It's their eagerness to forget everything that bothers them. Okay, now we can run. So what, are we just gonna make everything worse for them? Yeah. Because it doesn't really seem like we're doing a whole lot to improve things for the people on the other side of the firewall. Uh, I mean, we beat the shit out of those uh, leapers. In the shop. In accordance with the sanitary charter of Neo Paris, access to the docks is forbidden. <laughs> okay. Why do so many people want to go to the docks? They look like they're going to. Uh... Ah, okay. Save Mikael. Why is the E backwards? It's really terrible. Impossible. Just impossible. I'm late. I'm late. <sighs> <sighs> Dear Lord, I'm so very sorry, madam. Hey! Are you okay? Should I call for emergency assistance? No! No! Don't no. be a dick to the I'm robot! Fine. If you should desire so to file okay. a complaint, my identification has been saved by your Sensen terminal. Good day. Uh, so those finally, robots are horrifying. I've been 20 minutes. Yeah. You can even see they're beating hard. Maybe I was. It seems like you can see a bit of muscle fiber too, which is neat. Yeah. And their weird expressionless faces with their blank white eyes. I also like how the game closes the door behind me, so I'm kind of like, oh shit, I triggered a cutscene, so if there was a collectible there, now it's gone forever. Are there collectibles? Yep. 
channel fear. Channel fear. Does it just play garbage horror movies all the time? Is this your address, ma'am? Yes. Yes, I think so. Thank you. And somebody here seems if like they might be important. If you intermittent memorial access, you should activate your AUG compass before going out. Wait, it looks like we have another one there. Miss, are you okay? You seem lost. It's her! The escaped memory hunter! Okay. Patrol 17 log. That was a really good delivery. Recovery in progress. He's a cop. He doesn't know how to act. Okay. That's so I'm glad they knew it was you right away. I mean, I wanted posters are fucking everywhere. Uh, what? Okay. Overload? Oh, okay. Jesus Christ! He is fucking dead. I think you need to build up a combo to do the overload. No, I know. I'm just, uh, spamming dodge. Uh, this is pretty fucked up! It, uh, yeah, Ivy. He did say I can't see anything. Wait, wait, wait. Watch the body once you do that, Halo. Just... Really fucked up what you just did. Yep, they're fucking dead. Just ate their cyber ghost. Uh, their cyber memories, please. None of what you did is okay, is all I'm saying. Oh, look, they're waving at us. Yeah, it's because they didn't see what you just did. Okay. I need to look. Pay attention for boxes, I guess. I enter this, here. this music kinda sucks. Oh, wait, that's where I meant to grab. Taking the high road, huh? Your instincts are coming back to you. <clears throat> Who were they? The uniforms. Saber Force. Private police financed by Memorize. Saber Force. Saber Force! Sorry, I, I missed that. Did you just rocket across the gap? Yep. She's around here someplace. Sweep and search. Um, She's a pro. So keep glad there are just more of them now. Ah, fuck them. Oh, I am missing one health. Oh yeah, you, gotta recover that one pip. You, you see what I mean with like the camera and like how like everything is shaky and wobbly and flashy. Hey, yeah. Where the fuck did you come from? Neilan has remembered a new special present. Spressen. <laughs> Sense and Fury allows Lillian to free flow from enemy to enemy, striking harder every time. Don't break the flow. Okay. Press and hold uh, to open the press and wheel. Hold there, rotate and highlight that. Okay. When in Fury, Lillian will not use her combo. Just keep pressing X or Y to chain hits. The longer the Fury combo, the more dangerous the hits. Okay. Number displayed or the fury icon is the cooldown. It is the time and seconds you need to wait for freezing. Okay. Oh, you got it. 
Oh, God. They just teleported me. Okay, a new class of person is available. Oh my god. Okay. By performing cooldown presence, I will reduce all current cooldowns on her S presence. This is an easy way to quickly reuse your sense and fury. Use this new press to customize your combos. Okay. Yeah, sure. Yep, thank you for our folks. Got me. Okay, is everybody dead? Good. Okay, music. Is it we didn't need you. Like, the comment music was fine and now this started. Yeah. No, I, I appreciate this this incredible music for the sweet camera sweeping action. What? Oh, okay. I have to, like, not drop. Patrol 17! Answer, Dennis! Come on, guys, where are you? What's this bad request guy look like? Young, nervous. Yeah, the camera in this game is fucking camera. terrible. A wannabe memory hunter faithful to the cause. Oh, and he's your biggest fan. Give me a little 48%. Wait, why is that robot sleeping? Look, you've never wanted to fuck a robot? Like. I, I said sleeping, not like. Never mind. <laughs> yeah, there's a lot of really weird design decisions I don't care for. Okay, you remember two milk jugs, but how? what do you think of two vodka bottles? I was more distracted by the graffiti, but there's five vodka bottles. Oh no. You are what you remember, says Cyber Banksy. Oh right, uh, you missed that torpid. We're officially an terrorist. There's, Sorry, what? It's like terrorist except terrorist. Ah, we just slice off the, the tea. Exactly. Oh, okay. There's high voltage up there. Engar. I'm glad I'm playing this in a same semi-lit room You're because I think the white flashes would kill me. Force has lost your trail. Well done. I also really hate the constant use of like dumb code words. Cause they all sound real fucking stupid. I wanna go to the restaurant. What's wrong with you? You okay? Liberty, equality, madly. Also, look at her like, look at her regular jump, like when she's not in acrobatics mode. I bet it doesn't look right. Okay, 
I thought that said me Memopolis, like Memopolis, like memes. Finally, the city promised, as by YouTubers. Utopia, but creating hell on the way. That damn Sensen network was his first stab, and look how that's turned out. He's the boss of Memorize. No, he's the star genius, the capricious talent that gets to tinker away in his ivory tower. Memorize CEO is his wife, Scylla Cartier Wells. One name, two heads, a thousand reasons to bite your fingernails. Okay. I'm yeah, this guy really lives up to his name. Why can't I punch this pigeon? Because that pigeon is a paying customer. Look at it shuffle. I love it. I love this pigeon. This pigeon is my friend. It's a pretty good pigeon. Can you dare hurt my friend? Shuffle, shuffle. Openness, freedom from fear. Oh, look, they're socializing. Remember, long live la commune. Ooh, it's open. I want to buy stuff. Why can't I buy stuff? Yeah, we need that 30% discount. Ah, bad request. These names really suck. Uh, you miss when we went to Slums 404. New in the hunt. What is this man's everything? Biggest fan. Thanks. I've already scouted a route. It's not the first time I've been shopping in the land of the rich. I'm looking for the architect's offices. Everything's in here. An hour ago, I memorized the ideal path to avoid the surveillance drones. You just need to take it. It's an incredible honor to Buddy, this is a gross sex like thing for you, isn't it? I think she's definitely a gross sex thing. I think she realizes. Got the achievement, open mind. You done? Did you get everything? Yes. Follow my past. A trail of remembrance with everything you'll need to get past the drones through the comfortress. All the Thanks, way I'm to gonna Charlie kick shame the fuck out of him. I've sprinkled the route with memo boys, anchored just so they'll tell you when to activate my remembrance. Remembrance. And I appreciate the fact that you didn't siphon my head. <laughs> For a second there, I thought you might wipe our encounter. <laughs> Remember you soon. Remember you soon. Oh my god, they are really like going all in. He's my biggest fan. Yeah, it's pretty awful, and we really should have wiped that meeting. Hello, Nelly. If everything went to plan, you were talking to me a few minutes ago, and you've now got access to this remembrance. Repeat what I do. Oh my God! Shut the fuck up. your way through to your target. You better be ready, because here we go. Memory hunter wannabe. <laughs> your sense end will overlay the space around you with the memories I have of this area. Using your glove, you can synchronize with them to reveal hidden information. There you go. I'll let you synchronize. We'll meet up on the other side. Okay. Cash for memory. Cash memory! Oh, am I gonna have to fight those people? Hey, squares! Oh, I can't climb from leave. Hey, squares. Do you need to be behind them? No. To uh. Nope. Don't. Okay. You just over them. The blue cage is the focus cage. What's the focus cage? Every time you hit an enemy, and every time you get hit, okay. Overloading enemies gives you a focus bonus, okay. Oh, using an S press. No, okay. I. I Oh, they're all dead. Oh, uh, good, pretty right. Yeah, let's just go up. 
Shame the game forces you to fight because the fighting seems really not great. Hey, I'm back. It's, it's, play, it's like a budget got other hand. Like in terms of like the combo system. I mean, the music seems all over the place. Yeah, during fights it's really cool, but then in between it's just like, oh, I guess we'll add some music. Like, what is dramatic about this? I don't understand. Well, it's like this weird combination of orchestral and electronic that just doesn't work in this case. I just don't say like like while I'm exploring why it's so intense. Out the water. Why didn't I get an achievement for that? What's this? Uh, okay. These images are the hidden collectibles. Great. Marsh, you figured it out. <clears throat> you you, you cracked the code. First, you're right. Stay clear of their detection cones, and you got nothing to worry about. The problem is seeing their detection cones. I threw together a device that allows me to see them as an overlay on my sense So each time you activate my remembering, you'll be able to see them through my memory. Huh? Okay. When you cross the drones, be careful. They don't ask questions first, if you see what I mean. Okay, that's the detection cone. Stay clear of their detection cones, and you got nothing to worry about. The problem is seeing their detection cones. Okay. I threw together a the device. The here somewhere. What was it on there? More paying customers. More milk jug pairs. Who is drinking all this milk? It's the pigeons. Just a little jump to the finish line. Okay, so there's some cotton holes down here. Not how to do it. There we go. Oh, good job, me. Alright, you really fucked that up. It's a compilation of my best arrests. Uncensored. With Christmas murder, you get the best of Christmas all year round. Okay, that was good. Damn, I want some Christmas murder. This kid Christmas. I knew him. He's a memory hunter like me. Was. He's the shame of your profession. Could have been a genius, but he traded his soul for a fat paycheck. I, I want to turn on the shower. I love Christmas murder. That's really nice piano design. Ah, there's something at the red door. <laughs> I love how it's like this cultured, you know, piano background music and like all this like nice modern Furniture, but the guy watches ex Christmas Murder on two TVs. Sophisticated and trash. Exactly. Truly, this is what rich white people are. Also, like racking my brain to figure out where I've heard that piece before. Uh, it's I can't remember the name of it, but it's it's a classic piece. I, I know. I'm just trying to figure out like where I last heard it. Uh, am I moving? Okay. 
Ah! Camera? Um, this is bad. Okay. Wow, that was not good. Yeah, it switches the camera angle a little bit too early. Is it time to fight Christmas murder? No, it's time to fight Easter murder. Sense and fury. I think I was hallucinating. Like, I think I, I when, hmm, for a brief second when you uh, activated your your sense and fury, it sounded like there was a cougar noise in there. <laughs> Maybe there was. I don't know. <laughs> I might be losing it, but I feel like there was. Okay. It took me a while to understand what uh, Og Eye is, but it's basically it just rotates a camera to where you need to go. Oh fuck the fuck off. I kept mashing that when I saw it. I was like, oh, is it like a hint for collectibles? Are we going to be climbing much longer? Kaori Sheridan loves to contemplate her creations from her balcony. Keep following bad requests, remembering it. I like how he didn't answer your question. <laughs> Can I jump on this pot? My god. L l look at that, like, Not quite you baby jump. Like, not even just like a baby jump, the animation just does not look good. She can jump while in combat, she can do like tr a turbo triple flips, but like outside of combat she's just too bored. And yeah, the only time she feels alive is when she's stealing someone's memories. Just eating those memories, that's her adrenaline. Chomp chomp. Wow, just closed the window on me, sure. What a fuck. Sorry, I was trying to see where there were two milk jugs anywhere. Ah, there we go, two milk jugs. Do you see that? Mm -hmm. Man, Neo Paris loves its milk jugs. But you never drink milk jugs alone. That's important. Well, yeah, you got a fucking shotgun, two to milk jugs. Summers, we're going to exploit a privacy statute that forbids drones from scanning through walls. The, the milk jug challenge is super popular in this whatever future. Oh, okay, that runs the camera there. Let's see where the gate is. Oh, is that the gate with the collectible? No, it's not. Try to keep up. Okay, we're gonna use the wall as cover from the drone scanners. Get behind it and stay out of sight. There we go, collectible. Hell yeah, Neo Paris VR Poos! <clears throat> I don't know, something about this game is. Eh. It was very eh. Yeah. 
Please, nobody make a seems very forgettable joke. Try to keep up. Like, it doesn't seem outright terrible, it's just. eh. kinda bland. Okay, okay, we're gonna use the wall as cover from the drone scanners. Get behind it and stay out of sight. Also, Square's already made it. Should I. should I banner? No, it's fine. Like, I, I, I think it's like a mix of things that just makes it really cumbersome to play, like the camera... Like, look, like I'm saying, I look at how like like slightly shaky the camera is and stuff like that, and like the flashes, it's just like very exhausting to play. Also, the aesthetic is really not good. I don't like that, that whole glitchy look. No, no, I don't like that either. Critical. Also, there's not a whole lot of color. I mean, it's 2003, color wasn't invented for video games. Where the fuck did you guys come from? How's the combat? Really sucks. It's because the punches feel so weak. Also, the combat system is, like, way too complicated for what it should be. Yeah, like, I honestly would probably would've been fine with just strict, like, traversal and whatnot. Like, I don't know, the combat feels like it's just getting in the way. It's not particularly interesting. You should be close to your target now. What kind of memory am I looking for, exactly, inside this woman's head? Miss Sheridan directs the It's Phoenix like a budget part, Arkham the Neo Paris game. Global renovation. I want to know. But trying to add that was the customization. The dam overlooking the district. Why? Let's just say I'm a believer in the free circulation of persons and goods. Okay. Like, if you go to the combo lab, and I'm sorry I turned on this extremely bright pause menu, but it's like, I, I was first like excited because, like, ooh, like I can make my own combo. And it's like, no, no, you have these fixed combos. Those are your combos. You only pick the colors of the buttons. I'm kind of like, oh, oh, okay. I guess that's fine. Stop shaking in your shoes, citizens. Your champ is here. Oh, combat's super boring. Yeah. I'm about to give you the immense privilege of watching me sing. Let's see. Maybe make the traversal look a bit neat. Maybe, maybe, maybe we'll get new combo systems or something. Like new combos. I doubt it because it looks like you've seen the extent of it. Like, it's literally like... It feels like it needs better defensive options than just uh, dodging. Like, if it had a parry or something like that. Or, I don't know, like... More explodey punches. Like, she has, like, this memory burst. Like, why doesn't she have something, like, explode, like a fireball or whatever? I don't know. I hope, I, I hope it improves. I feel like it would have been better without it, at least as of right now. Because, like, the traversal's neat, I like the little touches in the environment and all that. Slurp it up. Where was I already? The dam? No, no, not the dam, huh? That's strange. It's really strange. Did somebody happen to steal my memory? Oh, I guess not. Get the security code. Transfer them to me. Edge, your bit rate's tumbling. <laughs> I'm just trying to hide the <laughs> Gotta get somewhere higher. Hurry. Let's see if I can find a clean channel. Your bit rate's tumbling. Or maybe like the connection is breaking up. That's also fine. No no, I like this more. Like it's some sort of streaming bullshit. <laughs> oh shit. Oh. Live streaming to you this memory theft. Okay, I didn't die. Wait, so how is this? Oh, okay, it's like broken. 
a uh, Azure. Okay, so how does this work? Okay, it's broken. So, what? Oh. Come on, that one. Just gotta download more RAM. So how fast is this? Oh. Okay. You know, if, if somebody uses the phrase, you gotta download more RAM, I will forgive all the sins of this game. Wow, it says way too much about me that hearing this piece just reminds me of Jersey Devil. <laughs> it reminds me of a random Disney movie. It reminds me of Jersey Devil, and I hate that fact. That is the first thing I thought of. I, I, I'm gonna go on a limb here and say that this is probably better than Jersey Devil. Okay, yes. This is bland. Jersey Devil is terrible. Oh man, topical, huh? Dylan, you lead me. Nilan, Edge, do you read? I read you. I got around kids malware. Send me the codes. Hurry. Okay, uploading them. Perfect. All that's left to do is to hack into the San Michel Dam mainframe. Caught red-handed. You errorists are shameless. Nilan. All these years, and still choosing the losing side. We know each other! You were Do I know best you? <laughs> hunters ever. Big girl. Maybe the best, but you took a different road. And look where that got you. A criminal, hunted, and a head full of holes. Political ideals are so last millennium. You always waste so much saliva! Or is it just when you're on the air? You always had that cocky, loudmouth thing going for you. I'm gonna enjoy this. Time for the Christmas show! He looks like a low grade platinum bad guy. Yeah, I was gonna say, when did this turn to Anarchy Reigns? Yeah. Like, why does everything look so shitty and glitchy? Ugh. Because it's a cyberpunk future. Ah, uh, I see, where nobody can render anything for shit. Uh, okay. Am I gonna get a tutorial? No, okay. Okay, let's see, what happens if I do this? I swear I hear like a cougar noise in there. It's her persona coming out. Oh, he okay. has gold teeth. Of you course, he's the taste of kids' hammers. It's time to meet the Spider! I'm sorry. Well, they couldn't call it a hammer. It's the future. Is are you just gonna like spam Hadoukens at me or something? He is. Okay. I, I can respect that. How? Uh, yeah, I was thinking the same. Okay, I'll just spam super meter, I guess. Did you say you better be sandbagging? I didn't catch it. Ow. Please. Please stop spamming, it's not okay. Hey, it is called the spammer. Oh, 
Well done, big girl. We're here through to the final segment of the show. Shut up and fight. <sighs> Excellent proposition. It's time for... Sudden Death! No, that's... No, Sudden Death... That's not what Sudden Death means. I do appreciate the slowdown when he does a, a big attack. Ow. Music right now is pretty alright. God damn, this fight sucks. Yeah, I'm like too big on the gotta farm cooldown. Like because I'm not doing any damage until I do like my super. Oh, quick time events. Glad I, glad I knew those existed, huh? Oh, well, I'm dead. Like, they're not even consistent inputs, which I always hate in QTEs. Yeah, I'm... Okay, I guess if I have like, I don't know how to like attack a Martin with the super. Yeah, I think chat was saying you need to wait for the uh the charge. Okay, it's the same ampus at least. It's not randomizing them. Oh kid. All these years. Good job, you shoved I'm him. Still to the on the ground. losing side. Thank you. Not gonna slurp up his memories. No, not here. Not in front of my Not fan. on the first date. Can't believe we've messed him up live on stream. Slurp up his memories. No, no wait. We can talk. I can give you a whole other. <laughs> 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 Right side, we've got a gun. A handgun. Finger gun. Blam blam. Sorry, Axe, but I beat you to the punch. Leland, I guess you could say you were for the fist, codes you said the joke. The errorist counterattack will begin in just a few minutes. Use all this confusion to get out and make your way to slum 404. God damn it, really. Uh. Slum 404, really? Mm. Yeah. Okay, so... Ah, oh, there we go. Wait, what the sh Did I actually shoot it? Wow, that's like the weakest ass gun I've ever seen. Don't put gun shame. That, that, that's a really bad map.
Can I jump on him? No. Okay, well, I guess we're leaving. Any collectibles? Ah, yes, focus boost. She said it! She said the thing! Title got, drop. Got the achievement, Christmas At is over. At 7 this morning, sirens blared throughout the entire city when the Saint Michel Dam suddenly opened, releasing billions of liters of water from the San Luis artificial lake into the peaceful Saint Michel district. As you can see on these Sen Sen images, the gigantic wave swallowed everything in its way. The scale of this catastrophe is difficult to imagine at this time, as the Neo-Paris authorities are already reporting dozens dead and several hundred missing. On the other side of the dam, the sudden lowering of the water level has not gone without consequence for the inhabitants of Slum 404, a neighborhood well known for ongoing social unrest. The Sabre Force has immediately been deployed in and around the area to contain any potential riots. Indeed, the now empty Saint Louis Lake has put an end to the isolation of the Bastille Fortress, home of the most dangerous criminals in Neo Paris. Stay tuned for more. I feel like we need a moratorium on games set in the future using the word Neo in their city names. I like that this, the, the news network is called Plotty News because that means paid off news in Serbia. Or pay off the news. Using the architect's codes I'd stolen, Edge sabotaged the Saint Michel Dam, flooding the Comfortress. According to him, it was just desserts for those who only worried about their own comfort. Why did I do what he asked? I could have left the city, invented myself a new life somewhere else. But I wanted to come back to being public enemy number one. Was it part of who I am? Have we brought justice for the outcasts of Slum 404? Or have my actions condemned them to more suffering? Uh, Only a what militant do you think? believes that the ends always justify the means. Edge revealed to me that my memory had been conserved in the fortress of the Bastille since my conviction. I have to go there and recover my true self. The only way to get into the Bastille is with the memories of Johnny Greenteeth, a colourful resident of Slum 404. This the area is she's in looks like a more interesting areas, level than what we just played. Where he hides out. Too bad, we're not gonna play it. No. Maybe it's gonna be one of those Max Payne uh, nightmare sequences and we have to like follow a very thin <laughs> polygon line. No, I hope not, God. <laughs> so she's basically a centrist character. No, she's working for the rebels and the rebels are kinda all like, oh, these, these bourgeoisie are living a better life than we are, fuck them, let's flood okay. and kill them. Tommy can help you get back yeah, to the Yeah, she's a domestic Bastille. terrorist. Go yeah. back to his bar. Couldn't he have done that this morning when I was there? No. We had Didn't to drain Slum 404's their, uh... lower levels first. You got everything planned out, huh? The Neo Guillotines. She's kind of like, huh, am I maybe being used? Am I maybe the baddie? And... But she's still, like, playing along because she doesn't have anything better to do. I mean, Ax, the problem is that it's not about, like uplifting the lower class it's just about punishing the rich and only that yeah like it's basically justice by punishing the rich rather than alleviating the lower class oh, that's fair why'd you run away from that robot beer uh, i didn't i'm trying to see if there are collectibles i don't actually care about the environment i only want collectibles <laughs> <laughs> but the the the, the uh God, I forgot. Got the term. Shit! Environmental storytelling. Look, 
I would care about environmental storytelling uh, if I didn't have to find tiny, glowy, black, yellow collectibles in this weird environment. Look, there's not enough skulls and toilets for it to be environmental storytelling. There are milk jugs, though. But not in this. This is like a lot of milk jugs. These are the slums, which don't have milk jugs. Milk jugs are only reserved for the uh, upper class, the bourgeoisie. Ah, the milk drinkers. The milk drinkers. Nice. That's what we're gonna call them. Actually, I wonder. The milk havers and the milk have nots. <laughs> Actually, I wonder. Are there any milk jugs here? It doesn't seem like it. They can't afford milk. Happy hour, no squalling. Yes, Bob, I mean you. Wow, rude. Yeah, fuck that Bob guy. Scaramax are parasites that feed on ambient memory transfers. Listen carefully for your distinctive sound to locate them and shoot them with the spammer to gain a pimp bonus. Okay. Okay. Things took a bad turn around here. Wow, that took a while to die. Yeah, it takes a really annoying number of shots. You're fighting some Scaramooks. The question is, will they do the Fandango? God, Edge is such a bad name for a character. Oh yeah, that's right, they're called Errorists. I hate that. Is he edgy? Uh, he's pretty edgy. He's very edgy. Also, milk junk. But Finally, only one. Proof. Wait, no. There's the other milk jug. It got separated. Okay, but where are the empty vodka bottles? Uh, I don't know. Are there just like random dead people everywhere? Well, that's this. Okay, it's like in the fire area. A new combo is available in the combo lab. Okay, you could have told me this before I was getting ready to fight people. Oh, there we go. We got I a new combo. I think it was just activated. Got a new combo. Oh, I, I I don't have any presents. You activated the wrong one, motherfucker. Uh, well, I need you wise, so... Okay. Still don't understand what this pimp counter is. It's XP. And we I feel use like it to buy could have given it a better name than pimp. See, it helps you give a better slap. It's it's an acronym for something really dumb. Okay, but it's still terrible. It comes out to pimp. Or pump, like fist pump. Eh. Or pimp. It's actually pomp a pompadour. Oh man, I wish we had a pompadour. Yeah, unlock the pompadour. Death is empty. Gonna stick it to the rich by beating the shit out of some poor. Yeah. So yeah, that's kind of the thing. Is like a lot of your anger and fighting seems really unfocused. It's been so long, I don't even remember what I'm fighting for. Okay, so... You're just kind of beating the shit out of anything with a pulse. And then stealing the memories. Oh, wait, the save. What did you? Like, X, we, we convinced a bounty hunter her, her husband was dead, so she wouldn't fight us. Well, okay, we, that's actually awesome. We didn't convince no. her, we altered her memory so she could see the painful death of her husband. Okay, that's yeah. not awesome. Yeah, no, because he was alive and she was paying for his medical bills. Yeah, that's okay, why she that's was Okay, that's extremely not awesome. It's getting worse the more you tell me. Yeah. No, our character is a terrible person. 
Her arc better be just like soaring. Bits. Because this is awful. Babes in the shell. Hell yeah! Fuckable robots. Yeah. Probably get all the bits on Twitch. There's something that you'd like to tell us, Torb. I know what you mean. Nothing, nothing at all. Okay. I like this open 24 7 private party and just like another corpse here. It's just like, oh, how do we know these are the slums? Because there's just like random dead people everywhere. Please. Not dead, he's just passed out. He's just kipping on his back. Beautiful plumage on him, though. Seems that to me. Uh, is this person dead? Or just died very uncomfortably? Everybody's passed out, they're not dead. I am the remedy to your sadness. Take my <laughs> Poor people are insane. Uh, no, these these guys have a reason to be insane. Yeah, their memories have been like completely eaten and shit. Oh god, I have to shoot now. Okay. Memories like Swiss cheese. Use your piff gun. So the gimmick here is... Uh, the gimmick here is I need to kill these, like, regular leapers because they're powering up the big dude. And then when they're all dead, I can kill the big dude. Okay, but this, this soundtrack is ridiculous. No, no, the combat music's pretty all right. Yeah, I don't mind the common music, I just don't like the in-between music. Oh, I don't have- Yeah, to. I don't think you've noticed how ridiculous the music is get acts. Like... I know that it switches between this and some poorly done orchestral stuff. Yeah, like weird sweeping orchestral scores with some slight electronic shit added in. <laughs> And one of the orchestral bits reminded me of Jersey Devil, and I hate that fact. Hey, can you shoot gun? Oh, uh, I can, but he seems to be losing his block anyway. I also feel like like this would benefit a lot if after combat she didn't immediately go into like super straight pose and said like kind of like I don't know had a little bit of a breather or said something like anything hello Janine Janine is waiting for us though damn Janine can wait 32.8 let's go visit Janine I remember her I don't See, all I can think of is, uh, Remember Me from the Phantom of the Opera. I see, I have no familiarity with that. It's a good song, you should listen to it. Nah, I'm good, I don't really care for it. that sort of thing. Is that progress? I think it's progress and I think you're locked. Oh my fucking god, really? Well, there was probably a collectible there. Oh well, who cares? Jax? This ad? I've heard it before. That's a good sign, sister. It means your core memory resisted the treatment. But with all the latest innovations, making him toy number one this season. Jax the Panda, a Happy Place product. Happy Place, the place for fun. Jax knows everything. That's a pretty good panda. Can I like drop? Oh, I died. Never mind. I mean, you can. Oh, no. This ad. Okay. That's a good sign, sister. It means your core memory resisted the treatment. Isn't the happy place a place for happiness? Okay. Let's jump over 
for this. Yeah, yeah, that's a cougar sound. You weren't imagining it so good. Uh, really? Now? Of all fucking times? <laughs> Literally in the middle middle of my rage-fueled battle, and you're like, Oh, press select to the sensor menu. Oh, we have a special <laughs> message from our sponsor. We know you're in the middle of combat, but we've got a new mechanic to show you. Okay. Oh, okay, this changed the previous one there. So. No, I want to exit the combo lab. I want to readjust this and I'm happy with this. So, I want this here. Then. This here. This here. Okay. One day we'll have this final combo. Okay, can, can, can I have fun then? Thank you, game. Like the combat doesn't like break up the action so much as just interrupted awkwardly. Yeah. Oh shit, I'm gonna die. Like I, I get it has all these mechanics, but it still just kind of feels like filler. Yeah. Maybe you have to use the gun. No. I'm telling you, there's a cougar noise in there. It is. Yeah. It is. I said. I hate it. No, no, it's it's good. It's super good. It's fitting, but I hate it. Okay. Fitting for this game, not the setting. Okay, now we have a new pressing. Also, once again, all the code words sound terrible, like, not something somebody would actually come up with. Yeah. Like, I feel like this combo system could have been, like, a smidge more interesting. It's named this way because once you unlocked all the great stuff, you'll be impressing. Okay, uh, where am I meant to go? Oh, okay, I was not there. Insane in the brain pain. No, no, it's remembering. Is this up here? 
Oh, you wow. joke, but that is a term actually used, Axe. I know, I saw the remembering thing. I made the insane other remembering joke. Uh, Marsh, I pressed the button, but I didn't get anything, so... I guess it only works sometimes. Carnival... Carnival, you are wrong, actually. A lot of these environments are kind of bland. Uh, but more importantly, the glitchy effect for all of the sci-fi stuff looks terrible. What is that? Oh, that's a package down there. I'm gonna grab the package. As soon as the camera lets me see where I am. And when the camera isn't being terrible, like, the traversal seems pretty neat. I don't mind the traversal, I just hate shaky, glitchy, Dutch angle cam. Man, the surge too took some weird Neil, turns. I'm waiting for you at the leaking brain. I'm looking forward to helping you find Johnny. Johnny? Johnny Greenteeth, the bogeyman of Slum 404. He still remembers all the old passageways beneath La Bastille. Yeah, at least that's what Edge says. Okay, I'm inbound. Later, you find out Edge has a brother named Cut. Uh, later we find out Edge will actually betray us, and we'll be really surprised by that. Like, I don't know, this feels like... I'm rem remembering a lot of, of uh, Binary Domain, where like, Binary Domain was this like, double-A game with extremely good shooting. And this is like, oh man, you'd hope this is like a double-A game where everything else is kinda whatever, but the punching is really good, but they didn't get the punching down. Like, if only the punching felt good, I would have a much better opinion of all of this. I think it's like, mostly the sound effects that fuck it up. Also, enemy variety doesn't seem to be that good. So far, at least. Ah, now the Xenomorph comes. Oh, we're getting invisible enemies. What was that? Also, why don't cops have guns? Uh, uh because they're illegal in Europe. What do you think this is, America? Why don't they have less than lethal options? I don't know. Well, they look like a cop? I don't know cop things. Shit, you're right. Well, you're asking quite a lot of questions, Torpid. Are you a cop? No. No. I don't fucking trust you with that response. Okay, so let's see environmental storytelling. They were drying their laundry, cooking some, what is that? Stew. The stew. Having something from the diktat. Uh, what are you drinking milk? Are there any milk jugs here? I do not see any milk jugs. That's why they're dead. Ah <laughs> oh, yes, they are the milk have-nots. No milk, no life. Hmm, this looks like an arena. Where I will fight something. Okay. Let's see, I complain about lack of enemy variety, I want to see the invisible enemy type. What's this all about? Ah, okay, I have to turn on the light. Seem like I need light. Tommy, 
I just had a run-in with some leapers. Scary. They vanish at will. I stopped being surprised by any of the evil shit that comes out of those tunnels a long time ago. I'll be there soon. Until I get there, keep your eyes peeled. Like in theory, that seemed interesting, but in execution, it looked really bad. I mean, it's the same enemy type, it's just like being, um, like, it adds a side activity, which is break down the light. So you can actually, like, see where to fight them. So I jump down there. Oh no, there it is. The only problem is that the enemies all do the same thing. Um, Climate change exodus, civil war. They don't actually have like Each different move sets. Yeah, I feel like like at least give one of them a pipe or something. We are confronting the leaper threat with the reconversion project. Finally, we can lay this generation's catastrophe to rest. We're gonna fight the leapers with the creepers. Well, it's like the only thing there's right now is like target prioritization, which is okay. You have a big guy, and you have to kill the little guys to be able to do anything to the big guy, and like that's so far the only decision making while fighting. Other than that, there's no reason to attack one enemy or the other. It's just like okay, you just keep punching and kicking. Like just like having like a ranged enemy, like having them throw shit at you. That would immediately like add much more variety because then you can like make an informed decision. Oh, do I kill the ranged enemy because he's attacking me with his projectiles and I can't dodge, or do I attack the melee enemies because they're rushing me? But here's just like and the answer is yeah. Well, that's what I kind of meant with the cops because like it's weird that they're just using the baton. Uh huh. That's why you why you said it. yeah. Definitely not a cop. I'm definitely not a cop. Rent a box! Fuck yeah! No wait! Wait, really? Fucking really? Oh my god! <laughs> like, I do like the, the little touches in the environments, even if they're not always the most, like, interesting environments themselves. But I just like all the environmental stuff. Okay, but Torben, if you want to rest, you can rent a box. Like, the, the environments look really pretty, and they're, like, obviously not, like, the same copy-paste stuff. It's, like, actually, like, really decent environmental design, but it's just, like, the color selection makes it look really boring. Okay. Also, like, these very obvious enemy arenas really take away from it. Yeah. I wonder if they take less damage when the light is on. I think you just like can't target them unless they're point blank. Okay. Shuts down all senses, stuns all enemies, reveals invisible ones. Okay. Okay. Really denial of service. Yeah. Oh, that is an awful effect. Yeah, sorry, but great. I mean, the bitrate handled that just fine. The problem is it looked terrible. Yeah, it was just intrusive.
like when they came up with that visual effect, they really only thought about whether or not it'd be cool and not, you know, would this be intrusive to the actual gameplay? They're like, the, ma look cool. the main menu is like actually caused motion sickness for me and like uh, death was had to look away from the stream until I was done with the main menu because it was basically super wobbly, angled, uh, glitchy. Ooh. Like really bad. Also, a lot of time it just feels like the combat is just waiting to build up to your Sensen effects. Mm hmm. No, I, that one, that one's fine. I'm trying to look at that one up. This is, this is kind of tedious. Just jump down, stop being a coward. Oh, I thought you were trying to power something. No, it's just for climbing. I also could have sworn the ladder was on that wall. Alright, health this wall. I'm sorry to tell you this, Axe, but that wasn't Pipe Dream. Thank god. The best minigame ever. Oh, I fucking hate Pipe Dream. P Pipe Dream is like 30% of the reason I hate Bioshock. <laughs> I'm really good at Pipe Dream. I'm good at Pipe Dream yeah, see, as I was well. I'm good at it, so I really enjoyed it in Bioshock because it made getting through all the hacking stuff super easy for me. I am pretty good at it. I just don't like doing it 300 times. <laughs> yeah, well, I didn't like the timing shit in 2, so it was me. Oh, I, I, I don't know. The worst hacking I have seen was in Prey. No, the worst hacking I've seen was probably in Mass Effect 2. I don't know, I didn't like Fallout 3's hacking. I don't know, I always found that one pretty easy, so once again it never really bugged me. I don't know, it's, it the, it's, uh, it's easy, it's just boring. The, uh, finding the word one? Yeah. Yeah. I didn't like it until I found out that you could actually get extras in the code. Yeah, no, I just, I hated Mass Effect 2's, that was one of the worst, which is you see this scrolling various images of text and you have to match the correct ones in the right order and resets every time you get a new one. I'll be honest, I don't even remember Mass Effect's minigames, it's been so long. Okay, but let's let's talk about Tower of Hanoi. Uh, let's not. Every, every horror game has to have a Tower of Hanoi puzzle. No, every horror game has to have that one puzzle where you have to move water from one end to the other, but you have jugs of different <laughs> sizes. Yeah, the Resident Evil 2 remake one. The puzzle where just everything grinds to a halt. It's like, <laughs> okay, time to spend like 20 minutes on this now. You've got three tubes, and you've got to get just the right amount of liquid into the last tube. Good luck, fucker. And Vic Pyro, it's not about like being realistic hacking. It's about being like a satisfying mini game. Uh, the thing with mini games is like, if you're meant to do it like all the time, uh, it needs to be something like super snappy that doesn't get boring, and that's really hard to develop. Like, uh, like lock picking in. Skyrim and Oblivion is a pretty good example. Like that one doesn't get like too boring, um, and it's pretty like easy to execute because you have to do it all the time. Actually, I'm not entirely correct. Uh, one of the other bad ones is uh, Deus Ex: Mankind Divided. If 
If Resident Evil ever does a Sudoku puzzle, I'll never finish that game. And they did do a tile puzzle, and that was fucking miserable. Yeah, but there's at least a trick to solving tile puzzles. I hate tile puzzles with every fiber of my fucking being. See, I used to too, until I learned how to almost consistently solve them every time. Okay. And I don't care if there's a trick, I just find them terrible. Okay. My favorite puzzle, I need to pause this because I already explained. My favorite puzzle is the one from Evil Within with the bloody uh, tablet, where you have a tablet, there's only two ways to put it, like uh, like it's a flat tablet, you can only put it like uh, one side out of two, but if you put it in the wrong one, a bunch of spikes kill you in the room, and you have a tablet, and one one side of the tablet is covered in blood. You it's see pretty what, good. It's pretty good, and I thought I was like, oh, this is actually really clever and funny, and then later, later, Scruffy, because he did an LP on it, told me that he had a bunch of people complaining to him how they didn't understand the puzzle. Because the basically the idea is somebody before you tried to do the puzzle, and they did it wrong, and then you just literally have to put it in with the bloody side inside. Yeah. Okay. Even wouldn't have uh, pretty good puzzles. I like that game. Marsh, you are right, there is a trick to solving Sudoku, and that's not to do the damn Sudoku. Oh, I, I like Sudoku. Which is fair. I've, I've never been fond of it. Oh, there's more people, okay. Yeah, that seemed like the main comment loop is just like, fill up your thing, and use it. One thing I'll give them credit for is being a little restrained with those stupid effects, where like, the lower your health gets, it doesn't start like, glitching out. We haven't gotten super low on health, so I don't know if it actually does that. To be fair, Marsh, that scene was very fucking good! Yeah, the- the- Sudoku puzzle in 999 was really fucking funny. I was so confused when I first like played it. I know, but it was incredible too, because it's like this culmination of all this bullshit in the game. It's like, oh, let me hold my 3DS completely upside down. To be fair, I still say 999 has the best use of the, the two screens I've seen in pretty much any DS game. Okay, but let me counter with Legend of Zelda the Legend of Zelda Phantom Hourglass with one that puzzle, game. With one puzzle that can only be solved by literally closing the DS. Uh dude, let me tell you if you think that's good, let me tell you about Hotel Dust man. Yeah, I was about to say Hotel Dust. That game's fucking great. I don't remember there being a thing where you had to close the or I, I still like, uh, what was it, Pokemon X and Y, where they introduced a Pokemon that relied on the, uh, the gyroscope. Anyway, cutscene. Womp womp womp. Hey, you wanna help? You can stick around, help me fix up my place. No can do. Bigger fish to fry. Fish like Johnny Green Tea. Uh, how's a boy to compete with a wet tunnel leading into leaper infested darkness, huh? Have a heart. Wonder how many of these people are gonna betray us. Sorry about your bow, Tommy. You be careful. The storm ruins. Uh, every time I hear that phrase, a part of me dies. Which one? There's a storm coming, there's a storm brewing. I feel a storm coming. <laughs> okay, but I appreciate that when you loaded into this bit, you loaded a bit too high so the game forced you down. That's, that's gonna be the twist, is just literally everybody you've dealt with betrays you all at once. But no, I, 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 I still think that 99 has the best use of the, uh, the touchscreen. 
I think this might be a good I should say the dual screens, not necessarily touch screen, but the dual screens. I think this might be a good place to stop, actually. Yep. Uh, as good think... a place as any, really. Yeah. Uh, anyway, uh, main menu. Hello, this is the entire main menu. Everything is angled and everything is shaky. Oh, this is awful. Yeah. Look at the video settings, that's my favorite part. Look at this. Oh dear god. I don't know, it, it's not good looking, but it doesn't bug me. Yeah, I'm not getting like, gro like nauseous or anything, but I could see how this would cause That said, I sickness. hate that it is blindingly white. Uh, I had to start at this like on my main monitor for like 10 minutes before the stream started, so I do not like it. <laughs> uh, anyway, we will be continuing this on uh, on Friday. We're gonna do a three-hour stream. So if you enjoyed the show and don't follow, please drop a follow. Um, there's also a Discord, so if you want to hang out, you can do that as well. And let me see if I can host somebody. I need to remember the Discord's my real good. I need to remember the routine because I haven't streamed in so long. <laughs> Who's streaming what? Uh, uh, Goatee is streaming some weird Resident Evil knockoff called Excalibur or whatever, so I say go check that out if you want jank. Uh, anyway, good night everybody, bye.